Namaste everyone, I'm Hadik Brajali from Pokhara, a 17 year old currently studying in 12th grade in Motherland Secondary School. It is simple for us to assume that the happenings in space have no bearing on life on Earth, that we don't need to take sustainability into account in the context of an infinite universe. Although environmental, social and governance issues exist in this area, why include space in this equation? But taking an out of sight, out of mind approach to Earth's orbit could have serious repercussions. We rely on critical infrastructure around the clock, including military, scientific and communication satellites, which are located in the low Earth orbit, LEO, a region of space between 160 and 1000 kilometers above our globe. Whether you are driving to work, checking the weather forecast or accessing high speed internet, you are utilizing a critical network of satellites operating in the low Earth orbit. And what is the outcome of that reliance? As more satellites are launched, the operating environment becomes increasingly complicated and dynamic. With space becoming increasingly crucial for key infrastructure, worldwide measures are required to assure continued access to the orbit. Space sustainability is defined by the United Nations as the ability to conduct space activities indefinitely into the future in a manner that realizes the objectives of equitable access to the benefits of outer space exploration and use for peaceful purposes in order to meet the needs of the current generation while preserving the outer space environment for future generations. In short, action is needed to ensure that mankind may continue to utilize outer space for peaceful and socio-economic purposes in the future. Because of the nature of this domain, international cooperation, shared standards and binding agreements must be formed and followed in order for sustainability efforts to be successful. So now let's talk about the vital threat to the sustainable space operations and sustainability in the orbit, which is Debris. But what exactly is debris? Space debris are defunct human-made objects in space, principally in the Earth's orbit, which no longer serve a useful function. The majority of the sustainability challenges in the Earth's orbit revolve around the amount of objects in the orbit. In recent years, the size of scientific, military and commercial operations has risen tremendously and this trend is expected to continue as additional satellite constellations into the orbit. Although much of this hardware is safely deorbited at the end of its operational career, many of the items in the orbit today are no longer operational. Junk traveling at 17,000 miles per hour through space possesses a great risk to the operating satellites, main space flight missions, missions destined for other parts of the solar system and other debris. In 2009, an inactive Russian Cosmos 2251 satellite collided with an operating Iridium 3T satellite, resulting in the creation of almost 2,000 huge debris particles. These kind of collisions could set off a chain reaction that make LEO too busy and unsafe to reach, let alone utilize. Satellite operators must be watchful to avoid such incidents a task that will get increasingly difficult as the margin of error in the orbit continues to diminish. But now the question of what is being done to avoid such complications and promote sustainability comes in. Maintaining a sustainable environment in the Earth's orbit should be a prime objective for any entity with a stake in space access. However, adopting shared sustainability norms in such a complex and competitive environment is difficult. There are projects being established to address this, such as the Space Sustainability Rating (SSR). The World Economic Forum Global Future Council on Space Technologies was the first to introduce SSR. SSR considers on-orbit fragmentation risk, collision avoidance capabilities, defectability, defectability identification, trackability, data sharing, collision reduction, and other factors. The idea is to incentivize long-term mission design. However, there are numerous aspects to yet evaluate and assess. A sustainable future in space like on Earth is a viable, important step. There are enormous private sector prospects in the Earth's orbit, but each mission must safeguard and secure the environment for our greater good.